West Belfast man who was wanted by the police in Italy in connection with an alleged mafia money laundering operation says he's done nothing wrong. The Italian police have issued an arrest warrant for Harry Fitzsimmons, but his solicitor says no one has approached either him or his client about the matter. Julie McCulloch reports. This is the man the Italian police are searching for, Harry Fitzsimmons. Although he served time in prison for IRA activity in the 70s, those behind this current investigation aren't making any link to the IRA. They want to speak to him about alleged money laundering in the Calabrian region of southern Italy. So far they've seized almost £400 million worth of assets, including a large number of holiday homes. Back in Belfast, Mr Fitzsimmons' solicitor says his client had been conducting a legitimate business as a promoter of properties in the area, and that no one from the police here or in Italy had been in contact about these allegations. He was absolutely stunned when a member of his family emailed him a link showing this uh, issue about these properties in Calabria. And uh, he says he knows absolutely nothing about it. This has been a legitimate business. It's the first he's ever heard about any mafia involvement. He totally denies that he's been involved in money laundering. Calabria in Italy is well known to many people in Northern Ireland. Currently 61 families are suing an Italian lawyer over claims that his incompetence has left them without the holiday homes they paid money towards. Roisin Adams is one of them. She has paid out well over €150,000 for two apartments in a development called Jewel of the Sea, seized by Italian police in this current investigation. I haven't looked through those photos probably since 2007-2008 because, to be honest, it's too difficult and when I looked through them today, I just brought back all the memories of coming out and trying to just be shattered. There's no suggestion that Harry Fitzsimmons is in any way involved in the purchase of those properties. The police in Italy want to speak to him about other matters regarding money laundering and the Mafia. The PSNI has confirmed it's helping them in their inquiry. Julie McCulloch, BBC Newsline.